Hey everybody, Richard Knives here, your favorite knife tuber, episode number 117. I got something different today. So what I'm going to do is an unboxing. I never do unboxings, but I figured here it is. I might as well do it. Uh, full disclaimer here. This was sent to me by Big Idea Design. I did not pay for this. They sent it to me. I figured I would just show it to you. I think it's pretty cool. Uh, I uh, really wanted to show this to you, and I can't wait to use it. So let's uh, look into it. Let's open it up. Before we open it up, though, hold on one second. Yes, yeah, snag yourself one of these things. Mm-mm-mm. Man, that's good. Let's do it. I'm going to open it up with my GC74 Mustang with stuff all over it. That I don't know what that is. Stuff it's sticking. Get off. All right, let's do it. Make sure I don't cut anything. I think we're good. Let's open it up. Make sure it don't have nothing crazy in it. Here we go. Here's one. And here's one. And it's got the receipt thing in there. <clears throat> we'll get that out of the way. And we'll start with this. So, mini bolt action pin. Solid metal construction, lifetime warranty, do more, carry less. Pretty neat box. If seal is broken, remove from inventory. Oh, okay. Well, let's remove it from inventory. I don't wanna cut the box, how do I do this? Lightly. Okay, there we go. You only get one shot at unboxing, so I'm always afraid I'm going to look like a bloody fool opening this stuff. Um, let's cut this. All right, let's look at it. I'm pretty excited. Ooh, nice. Stuff in there. Sticker? Well, praise the Lord. I like that. I'm a sticker guy. Uh, thank you for your support. No, thank you for your support, Big Idea Design. Cool. We're here to help. See? They'll help you. Just give them a call. Uh, let's move this box out of the way. And just get right into it. Fancy. It's got the squishy foam. Shut this back from OCD. All right. It's in this plastic. How do I open it? I just... Come on. Well, for the love of Pete. Okay. I'm assuming the reason it's sealed up in that dude is because this is copper. And you know, once you touch it, it's going to get straight teeners, which I'm all happy about. This is pretty small. Um, how many inches is it? One, two, three and a half inches? Yeah, let's do it this way so you can see. Three and a half inches. Cool. I really like the clip. Oh, yeah. Let's do the thing. Ready? Oh, that's smooth. Yeah. Oh, this is going to be sweet. I like this. Let me show you the finish up close. So, it's got some, I guess you would call it, is it? It's not fluting. I don't bloody know what that is. It's nice though. It looks really nice. I really like this. This does not bother <coughs> or agitate or hurt my thumb. I actually have some pins that when you do that, your thumb gets ward plumb out. That's pretty good. Well, for Pete's sake, let's write something. I got paper. 
Hum. Don't be a hater from my handwriting. Hmm. That's pretty dang smooth. I'm not exactly sure what refill that is, but uh, from what I hear, this, I don't know what it is. Oh yeah, that is, that is a machine very well. You can barely see where you twist that off to change the cartridge. There's the cap. It's got one of them Allen screws. So you could take this uh, pocket clip off. So that's good. I really like this. That'd be nice in the pocket. Beautiful. I carry a copper pin every day if you don't know. And I probably use my pen more than I use my knife or anything else on me, to be honest. Uh, I write all day long. Sign my John Henry on everything. It's not fingerprinting the heck up either. I like that. I really like that. So, let me show you the other one. Let me show you. Okay, let's move this out of the way. And open this one up. Well, this one's a little larger, if you can't tell, just by the box. They gave me a full-size pin and a smaller pin. This one's different as well. You see it right there, it says dual side click. Never had one of these before. Oh, fancy. Works with ballpoint Parker style refills. If I had just read the whole box, we wouldn't be going through this. And rollerball style refills. How about y'all, Chattanooga? How about you? Fancy. It says copper, precision made, China. I could have swore it was from the U.S., but it's China. All right, let's open it up. Come on, feller. Pocket clip removal tool. What kind of fancy schmancy stuff is this? Three notch in cat spacer. Add the key ring for extra torque. I love torque. I'm in the hot rods and everything. Same little card there. Oh yeah, that's freaking fancy. Who gets this with a pin? Ha uh, Boy, this is a first class. Fancy. I don't even know what to do with my hands. Oh, yeah, I remember how this goes. You got to do this thing. Beast. Oh, hold on. Let's do the clickety-clack thing. Ready? Oh, that's quiet. Dual-sided clickety-clack. Oh, no, that's so freaking satisfying. Dude, oh, my wife is going to hate me. This is nice. I really like, this has a lot of heft down here too. Full size pen. Looky here, do my signature. Oh, there we go. Fancy. And on my signature, I just wrote, M for Michael. Squiggly, squiggly, squiggly. L. And then Richter. R. It's squiggly, squiggly, squiggly. You gotta cross the T. Nice. I cannot wait for these to get patina and get used because I'm gonna tell you right off the bat, the very first thing I like about these things is number one, the actuation on these is a. Uh, Smooth, very smooth. That is so satisfying. 
see my, I'm going to start writing on my hand. I, I could tell already. See, I just did it. That's fine. That is smooth though. It does not hurt. It's like rounded off right there. It has no knurling or jimping or any of that. This one, just that. And it's quiet. And that, it's almost uh, strange not to hear a click. But it clicks when you push this button. And I like that it's, you don't have to turn it to push a button. Wherever your dadgum thumb is, you know, you could push it. And it comes right back up. I like this so much. And this one I think is really good. Oh yeah, smooth. Right's great. Beautiful. Uh, you know I've been carrying uh, <clears throat> refined pins. And I love the refined pins. Um, I actually have one in my pocket. Let me show you. Got the refined pin. And uh, this one was given to me by refined also. And this one has black coating on it. And it must be paint because you can see the copper coming through after about, what, a week of having this? She's starting to get the teeners. That is very easy. It is a little uh, hard on your thumb. But I really like this. These write really well. So just a size comparison. This is the EP1, I believe. Um, hold on. Same size. Same, same, same. I like the clips on both of these, actually. So, love this. And uh, I don't know if y'all are pin people like I am. I guess I'll figure that out when I start seeing views on this video, but I got stuff on me. But I love a pin, and I love a good pin. I don't want to just throw a Bic in my pocket. Nothing wrong with Bic. And, um, you know, I, I like something nice. This one, if you buy it on their website, is a smooth Benjamin Franklin. This one, a little smaller, bolt action. This one is 70 bucks. I think that's a really good deal for these. It's full copper, really nicely machined, really. You can barely see the seam. Really nice machine. And another thing I like is when you write, it doesn't wiggle around right there. It stays. You know, I, I can't stand that when, you know, your your insert is wiggling around while you're trying to write. Fancy. Love it. Won't be long. It'll have <coughs> all the teeners. So 13 minutes into this video, I just want to say I'm excited about this. And uh, you'll see these updated with all the teeners um, when I do my pen collection. I'm going to put some use on these things. And I'll tell you what I really feel about them after a lot of use during my pen collection video. I've got quite a few pens. Uh, I'm looking for the one, you know what I'm saying? The one that won't leave my pocket. I'm always looking for that one. And um, love me a good pen. These look really good. I'm really happy with these right here. I promise you. And uh, can't wait to use them and carry them. All right. If you like them, hey, hit me a, a like right there. Subscribe button. It's the red one. Don't forget to tell your friends, your family, your mama and them, your crush, your barber about Richter Knives. Share this video. Do all the stuff. You know, comment below. Which one do you like better? Do you like the small bolt action? Do you like the larger uh, dual side click? Dual side click. And then you got the mini bolt action. Which one's your favorite? Talk to me, Goose. All right, it's Richter.
Yep.